All right, guys, so this is a continuation of my last video where I discussed replacing the blower fan slash combustion assembly, and I received the rebuilt one today. Um, for reference, this is the old one right here, and um, I mentioned in the previous video, it's just, it's making a, this motor here, it's making a loud whining sound, almost like a jet engine, and it's a known issue with the bearings inside of this motor, um, and I, I, I had mentioned it, I'm not going to try to repeat myself too much, but it's just beyond my skill to, to get that thing open, And but it might be something I try in the future, so... I ordered the whole unit from eBay, and it turns out it is actually the entire unit. I wasn't sure by the pictures if it included that back piece, but it di but it did, so that's that's nice. Um, so anyway, I reversed the instructions for pulling it out. I got it back in. I double checked all the connections, and I haven't put the front panel on or the top panel on yet. I want to give it a test first. So I've plugged it in, but I haven't. Um, I haven't actually set the temperature or anything. So it's September right now, and, you know, it's showing the room temp as 68. Um, so I'm going to just crank up the heat here to um, to get this to go on. So, and... So I can already tell you that it's um, significantly quieter than before. If you play the first video I posted here with a sample of the um, jet engine-like noise, it pretty much happens right away. I mean, as soon as you have this heater turned on and it's going to start working on producing some heat, this thing was a jet engine, and you'll see it in that first video. So... Um, already pretty excited because if this is how quiet it's going to be, minus the, you know, the actual fan in the back kicking on to blow the hot air, then I am extremely excited because this is night and day versus what was in here before. So it does take, you know, a solid five or 10 minutes before this thing, um, produces a flame and the, you know, the burn chamber gets going. So, I am not going to record the entire uh, several minutes here, but I am going to just let it actually produce heat so I can verify that it's that everything's 100%. But yeah, I mean, if, if it, everything's not 100%, then I will update this video accordingly. But it sounds like I'm good to go, and I'm pretty excited about uh, replacing this blower fan. So, all right, guys, take care.